Oh my goodness. Oh. Mm. Nice iced tea. Mm. Oh. 12 seconds later. Oh man, y'all been waiting. It's been a while. It's been a while, my gamers out here, YouTube land. It has been a while. Whoa, my goodness. What, what's up with you guys? What's up? I know y'all been waiting for that two months later of the ROG I like. Damn, man. It's been that long. For this, you've been waiting. You have been waiting patiently. Those that stuck around has been waiting patiently for this video. And finally, I am back and now back in my eyelash, back in my hands, and I can make this video. And I hope you enjoy it. And coming up, it's about to get good. It's about to get real. Coming right up. Coming up on CMG is about to get real. I'm about to talk to you. Why? You need. What do I think about the RG Online two months later? This is CMG. What is going on everybody out here in YouTube land? This is CMG and I'm coming back at you because I have returned with an exciting video, a new freaking video, a new video of the ROG Ally. And my God, man, I hope you smash that like button. It's got to get real. But first, I gotta forget it. Oh. Oh, the shades, the shades. Well, I wanted to talk to you guys. You've been waiting for a long time. For too damn long. And this video is if. What do I think is the ROG Lie? Is this the ROG Ally worth it two months later? Is it worth it? Well, we're going to tell you right now, and I'm going to show you reasons why. Yes, the ROG Ally is worth it two months later, and I'm going to tell you why. Because the ROG Ally, my gamers out here in YouTube land, my freaking gamers, the ROG Ally since its inception back in June 13th when it was released, it has been releasing. It came off, it started off a little rough. It started off a little rough with the, the CMG, the SD card situation. It started a little rough with the graphics situation. It had a lot of bugs, but you know what? Everybody has been criticizing the all OG Ally. They have been criticizing this machine. And it feels good to talk about this because they have been criticizing. But guess what? Updates have slowly been trickling. ASUS has been giving the updates. A lot of people have sold the ROG Ally. But you know what? I kept the ROG Ally. I had a little hiccup though. I had a little hiccup with the SD cards. Here we go! Here we go! The SD card reader was having its troubles, man. It was having a lot of troubles with the SD card readers, and I had to speak on this. Yes, I had to speak on this. I had to speak on this. But first, I had to speak on the situation with the ROG Ally. Yes, I like I was told you before, I was having trouble with the SD cards. I was having trouble because my system was not working. So that's a little bit of bad news right there. At the time, those that knew, when you see the pictures I was showing you, the SP, which is Silicon Valley, Silicon Power, what I'm saying, Silicon Valley, Silicon Power made by Taiwan. These SD, one terabyte SD cards, I had some, it was not working. So whatever was going on, my ally was not functioning. Things was going bad. Everybody was talking about it, but it happened to me. So there was a situation. So as you've seen the picture, I had to send this all the way to Newark, California. And that delayed my video because I already had a video coming up. Newark, California took about three weeks. As you've seen from the FedEx, Newark, California, I sent it out there from my hometown in the Bronx, New York, all the way to Newark, California. But then I had to get it RMD, RM8. I RM8 the device as well. They was able to get it fixed. Thanks to you for your inquiry. Repairs process has completed and your product has been shipped back to you. I have been honest. I'm gonna tell you right now, I have been on ASUS like a hot on rice with this. I have been on ASUS. I was not messing around. I stuck with this thing. And as, as, as you see from Newark, California, it's back out to delivery and I was able to get, get it back. And I already got the pages. They talk about they replaced it, the motherboard. So the motherboard was placed and ever since then, I did some te extensive tests with the ROG Ally and it's been working well. But as I was saying, the lightning speed of the SP Silicon Valley SD cards 
Bruh. This is an issue. A lot of people have been having issues. And I'm gonna tell you something about this. When you put this SD card in, this is the this is one of the reasons that you gotta be careful. I'm gonna show you right here. When you put the SD card in, you put the SD card in. Here's the eject button. The first thing you do when you put the SD card in, you make sure you know what you want. You do, you download everything you need. This is the this is the kicker. When you take the SD card out, you go and press that little button under there. You see that little icon. You go into that little that little shape. Press that button. Go to the icon. Click on that button and press the safety eject. Then you safely eject it as you see in the video and it's no problems and you put it back in there you go that's why people have a problem because people just be ejecting the card out and it corrupts the entire thing and it hurts the card another reason is that there's a little little situation with asus a lot of the motherboards a lot of the asus rg allies have been i think there's, there's been defective that's why a lot of people have problems. A lot of the rubber boards are defective. These are defective products. These are early products. And I think that it's going to improve. But ASUS, what you have to do is you have to send it into ASUS and they will RMA your device. It'll take about up to like almost a month, three weeks. They'll take care of it. They'll most likely give you a little motherboard. Give them the SD cards and you're good to go. But the reason, but that's not the gist of it. I just wanted to add that in here. But this is not the gist of this video is why in two months later, what I think about the ROG Ally. And what I think about the ROG Ally is that it's fantastic. It has gotten better. The updates has gotten better. There's a lot of great updates for BIOS 323. And now, as you see in the video, I'm able to go into 30 frames per second now. I could get 30 frames per second playing a little little bit of Watch Dogs, playing a little bit of Snake 8, 30 frames a second, then I, you know, I toned it down because them damn temperatures was going crazy up to 90 Celsius, so the game I'm going into, in the action, I'm blasting people, and actually the game looking crisp, it's looking fantastic, I'm loving the game, and I'm, I'm just telling y'all right now, it's looking fantastic, I'm going to go into details in my next video on the updates, but you, as you can see, I'm going to show you the pictures here, these are the updates, they have BIOS, and they have a recent update, they have BIOS, they had a new ASUS update that came out, and then there's another Army Crate update, Update that just came out and I'm gonna talk I'm gonna give you more details in the armor crate updates in the next video about the up updates because I'm not gonna really talk too much about that but I'm gonna tell you this gameplay has gotten better the bugs has gotten better this uh, two months worth later this system is fantastic okay the ROG ally has gotten a lot better since its inception it has gotten much better this system has gotten better and I'm really liking the system I'm liking the product that ASUS ASUS continues to do many updates and what I'm thinking about the graphics has gotten better since the BIOS 323, a lot of people have been talking about the performance has gotten a lot better. Since I, I put in the 10 frames a second, I'm getting good performances. There's still a little bit of some hic hiccups here and there. The performance has gotten a whole lot better. I'm liking the performance of the, of the system. It's just fantastic. I mean, the gameplay is better. And you can see how the gameplay is looking. Uh, Split Gate, you look at Dance X is looking fantastic. Dance X is looking pretty good. You also look at Watch Dogs 2 is looking good. Fantastic. The game is running fantastic. There's more modes. The, um, the command center is looking better. They've improved. They doing they steady improving the fan curves and everything. I have a whole new bubble board. Listen, two months later, and in two months, the ROG Ally has shoveled a lot of updates. You see all the updates. They just recently released the Army Crate update. I'm gonna talk about that in the next video. The Army Crate update and the details that has to offer. But I'm gonna tell you the Army Crate is a lot better. Everybody's been asking for time and all that other stuff. I'm gonna give you the details. But I just wanted to get you this quick video to let you know that I'm back and I have to talk about two months later. Is the RG I like worth it two months later? Hmm. Yes, as I said it earlier in the video, I'm telling you, this system is only going to get better. It's getting better. I, I, I'm telling you, if people want to sell it, that's on them. That's their prerogative. But for me, the system is worth it in every penny. It continues to, and it's going to get better. ASUS is starting to, to get to address more concerns about the ally. The ally is improving. The bugs are getting improved. There's still a lot of bugs that need to be fixed. It's not. Is this a, now I'm going to say this. Is this a perfect product? No. The ROG ally is nowhere needs to be perfect. Hey, I had to freaking send in my SD card reader. The SD card card works but you have to do it correctly you have to press the button the safety button to take it out that's why there's a lot of problems there's a lot of bugs with the system the um there's a lot of uh, defectiveness the system is fantastic but you may some people may have to send it in hey it's free send it in relax three weeks take your sd cards with them send it in and you'll be good to go but i'm gonna say this the rg ally is worth every penny best it do what you have to do it might have some it, it hopefully by the, by the by the next batch this system is not going to be as effective, but as the games, the games went fantastic. Everything's running fantastic. I'm liking it, man. I mean, the command center, everything continues to get better. The command center, the time update, everything continues to get better. I mean, it, it just continues to improve every step of the way, and I'm loving it. What, what more can I say? So, my games, let me know what you think about this video. Let me know what you think about this video of the ROG Ally two months later. Listen, 
I can't really go into details and two months later I just want to show you my opinion and which is really facts the ROG Ally is a must buy if you don't get one of these I'm not selling this no matter what it's gonna get tough but I'm gonna keep this and I'm gonna, I'm gonna rock it to the end and that's all I gotta say so my gamers let me know what you think as I say about this video and all I have got to say this out here you to let it sound off in the comment section tell me what you think about the video ROG Ally two months later is it worth it two months later and don't forget to hit that like button, share, and subscribe to see MG and to smash this like button, smash subscribe, and hit the notifications if you want more videos like this. As you seen today, I'd like to thank you for all of the support. Those welcome. If you come and click on this video for the first time, don't forget to hit that like button, share, and subscribe. Welcome to CMG Chariot Man Gaming. I got more stuff on the way. This is the, I mean, it's been three weeks and the am almost a month that I'm bringing this video out. So I appreciate those that, have, that took the time to wait. I am so damn sorry that it took this well, but I had to get the eyelid repaired. And now it's repaired and I'm back in action and I got another video coming on the way. Stay tuned immediately on the updates of the ROG Ally. And I have more streams and more gameplay. And I'm challenging all you people out there in Street Fighter 6. All you out there, I'm challenging you. You see this? I'm challenging you. Ready for the challenge? And I'm going to be on the Ally. You're going to be on Steam Tech or whatever system you're playing. And I'm going to challenge you. And I'm going to have some fun. We're going to game. So that's all I got to say. And I'm going to say peace. Keep it gaming. Talking to you. I'm going to talk to you guys soon. Wait, prepare for the next video. Peace. RG Online is worth it. Two months later, it is worth it. And that's all I got to say. Peace.